A hijacked plane was forced to land at Geneva International Airport after the co-pilot locked himself in the cockpit and took control of the aircraft. The Ethiopian man was arrested on leaving the plane. Passengers can be seen here disembarking the aircraft with their hands over their heads. Airport police said all 202 crew and passengers were safe. The flight took off from the Ethiopian capital Addis Ababa and was on its way to Rome when it was forced to land in Geneva, circling the airport several times before landing. At a press conference, Geneva police said that the co-pilot had surrendered to authorities and requested asylum in Switzerland. Geneva police spokesman Philippe Grandjean told reporters how the co-pilot took control of the plane. Immediately, all the services of urgence had been alerted. Straight away, all of the emergency services were alerted. At two minutes past six, the plane was put into full security on the runway. The plane was then immobilized and the co-pilot climbed out of the cockpit window using a rope. He was then arrested by police. The drama caused disruptions to other flights, including cancelled short-haul flights and others being diverted to different airports.